day days, many Muslims died as communists. Uz in Uzbekistan, Kazakhstan, Turkmenistan, Azerbaijan, Romania, Bulgaria, Albania, Yugoslavia, even in Afghanistan, millions of Muslims, they died as communists in the 1970s because communism was in its heydays. Today, in our time, millions of Muslims, they die as Democrats. They die believing in democracy. Most of the Muslims in Nigeria believe in democracy. Most of the Muslims in Malaysia believe in democracy. Most of the Muslims in India, Pakistan, Bangladesh, millions, they believe in democracy. Democracy is a new religion, the religion of the Satan. A Muslim is not allowed to believe in any religion except Islam. So all of you who believe in democracy, you are infidels, kuffar, outside the fold of Islam, and you are not allowed to be buried in the graveyard of Muslims because you die on a different religion. So why the Muslims are in this plight? In the 1970s, millions died as communists. And in our time, millions died believing in democracy. Why? Because the sheikhs are not telling them to reject the Taghut. They are telling them to believe in Allah. That is half of the shahada. The second half of the shahada is to reject the Taghut. No sheikh is talking about this on the mimbar. Rejecting the Taghut. So because of that, many Muslims, they believe in Allah, but they also believe in democracy. They did not reject the Taghut. So they die as kuffar. Allah Ta'ala said, La ikraf Let there be no compulsion in religion, because truth stands out clear from falsehood. فَمَنْ يَكْفُرْ بِالْتَاغُوتِ وَيُؤْمِنْ بِاللَّهِ the one who believes, who rejects faith in the Taghut, the false deities and man-made isms and schisms, and then believe in Allah, He has hold fast a grip which will never break. Baqarah 2.56 When you believe in Allah, that doesn't make you special. Even the pagan Arabs believe in Allah. The pagan Arabs believe in Allah. When they came to sign the Treaty of Arabia, they said to the Prophet, we don't want to see Rahman on the paper. Scratch out that. We don't want to see Rahim. We want to see one God on the paper. One God. Allah and Allah alone. They said that to the Prophet. Scratch out our Rahman. We don't know who that is. Scratch out our Rahim. We don't want that. Bismillahir Rahman Rahim. What's that? We want one God on the paper at the Treaty of Hudaybiyah. We want to see Allah alone on the paper. And they were pagan Arabs. And they insisted, we want to see Allah alone on the paper. We don't recognize any God except Allah. So when you believe in Allah, you are not special. Even the pagan Arabs believe in Allah. So what makes you special? When you reject the Taghut. That makes you special. 90% of the Muslims, they don't reject the Taghut. If you use the word Taghut, you say, what is that? What is Taghut? They don't know what is Taghut. Because no one is telling them to reject the Taghut. So they die believing in communism, capitalism, socialism, democracy, and all the man-made isms and schisms, the satanic systems, because no one teaches them to reject the Taghut.